It's round two of the playoffs. Thanks for joining us. A matchup between two Western Conference powers here in game two. Hi, folks. This is Brian Anderson. I'm with Grant Hill and Brent Berry. Our reporter tonight, Allie LaForce. Hey, Allie. Anthony Edwards is on the rise. Carl Anthony Towns said, quote, he already has the talent. We all knew that when we drafted him. But he just wants it. And he has that thing. Something you can't teach. It has to be built in. As to the ceiling, Edwards says, quote, I don't think I have one. I can be as good as anyone. Brian? Oh, tremendous, Allie. Thank you. And a look at Minnesota's opening lineup. Towns plays the four with Gobert in the middle. Filling in the wings, Edwards and McDaniel. And it's Conley in at the one. And for the Warriors, the core of the dynasty all on the floor. Curry and Clay, the guards, with Draymond up front at the four. Javon Looney is out there with Andrew Wiggins. So Golden State will get the first possession. The three from Curry drops in the three. The accuracy that Curry has from that kind of range is just jaw-dropping. He does not miss that many shots from that deep. Now here's McDaniels. Back to Conley. Who poked away. In transition, here come the Warriors. Out to Thompson. Pass to Curry. Here's the three. Another three for Golden State. That's just a good look for Clay as his teammate was open. Outside McDaniels. Back to Edwards. Now here's Conley. Now here's Gobert. Six to shoot. McDaniels. Looney grabs a miss. And he wanted to keep that shot from getting blocked, but in the process, he gave it no chance of going in because of how unbalanced he was on the base. Oh, not the defensive effort they need to cut into the lead. For a good call, you have to at least try to protect the rim. Good job to recognize the opportunity. That's just very solid offense. And so it's Minnesota with it. The Warriors getting their last shot to go. Here's McDaniels. This is off the right iron. Good shot. Gone bad. Got to finish there. Thompson passes to Wiggins. Alley oop on top. Hammer it home. He makes that look so easy. Andrew Wiggins up and down on the alley oop hole. And Minnesota calls time here. They're just giving away a run right now. The question is, can they stop the tie? Hard to say right now. At this point, I've seen the coaches run through two or three iterations of defense. Is there a fourth? I'm not sure. Get up and make some noise once again for your Warriors 16. A little over a minute and a half into this first quarter. Outside Edwards. Pass to McDaniels. Looking to win the run. Goes back up. Goes up again. No bear, no good. I mean, just a tough start. Missing their first five shots. Outside, green. Here's Looney. Count it. One for one to start the game. Five straight buckets to start the game. Off to a hot start. For Minnesota, they've gone 0 for 5 to begin this game. Pass to Towns. Outside McDaniels. And here's Conley. Nails the wide open jumper. Just a smart offensive player. Conley is aware of when he should look to rise and fire. Woo, I love it. And here's Curry for three. Another three for Golden State. And they've settled in quickly today. A nice flowing rhythm to their offense. Outside Edwards. Outside McDaniels. Back to Edwards. Launches it. Here's Gobert. He gets it in there. I love the ferocity from Gobert. Snagging that board and getting the putback. He wasn't going to be denied. Green's checked in for the Warriors. Kaminga comes in for Green. The Timberwolves making a switch here. And a chance for a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the Warriors. Well, we're in the era of the three-point basket. So if you want to win games in this league, you have to connect from deep. And they have been thus far. 
let's make sure that that selfish nerve doesn't get tapped because right now there's great ball movement. They're setting each other up. Let's see if that maintains. Exactly what every offense needs. Shooters who can force the defense to extend. Oh, there's no doubt. He's a legitimate threat from downtown, and he's demonstrating that in this game. Here's Noel. Let's it go. Here's Reed. The rebound by Wiggins. Golden State has gone four for four so far from three-point land. Impressive. Very excellent at reading the defense and taking advantage of any mistake. First personal foul. First team foul. And that one falls for Curry. And some changes here for the Warriors. DiVincenzo comes in for Andrew Wiggins. And it's Poole in for Thompson. Prince has checked in for Minnesota. Rivers comes in for Edwards. And so Curry nails both of them. Well, a great player on a great role at the charity stripe. But he has got to be careful about being too aggressive on him and sending him back for freebies. On the wing, Rivers. And he's covered by Curry. And the officials will call the illegal screen here. You're not going to fool the officials too often on an illegal screen. Yeah, everybody saw that one. That was pretty blatant there. Outside, DiVincenzo fires the three, nails it from three. And they are letting those threes fly from outside. Really in a great rhythm. Minnesota shooting just 22% in the early stages of this one. Timeout call, the Timberwolves. Man, it's been quite a game for Stephen Curry. And I think a new plan would be a good idea. At least make it hard on this guy. Time to get wild and make some noise for your Warriors fix team. Make some noise for your Warriors Junior Jam Squad. Here's Noel. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Prince can't hit. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Timberwolves. Timberwolves basketball. One forty-three left in the first quarter of the game. Noel, that's good. I like how Torian Prince moves the ball, consistent at getting it to his teammates within the offense. Right side, Curry. Another three for Golden State. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Curry's gone a phenomenal five of five from deep, really in the zone right now. 11 left in the opening quarter. Here's Anderson. The shot, no good. Excellent D there from Kuminga. Let's it go from deep. Another three for Golden State. All five of the last buckets they've given up have been from downtown. Pass to Noel. Here's Prince. DiVincenzo covering. Here's Rivers. Clock at six. Noel, no good. On the wing, Curry. 20 points for him. Another three for Golden State. A dozen consecutive points off of threes. This defense looks rattled. One second separating the shot clock and the game clock. Can they get it? And the layup is good. Noel's got his second bucket of the night. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. The three from Curry. Another three for Golden State. They've really built this lead on the back of their perimeter game. Well, a lot of importance placed on outside shooting. And tonight you can see why after that kind of quarter exploding from the perimeter. And the buzzer sounds to end the first. And we got a blowout underway here. The Warriors on top. 
running away with it. And the second quarter about to get started. We'll be back in a moment. as game two is getting underway. Boy, for the Warriors, this has been the game they've wanted to have. Well, it's simple. I mean, they started off strong, and they've been hot from beyond the arc since the get-go. They just couldn't seem to know what it was that they needed to do and how to stick them from outside. The defense pretty lost. On the court for the Timberwolves, second quarter underway. Townsend Gobert, the towering big man at the four and the five. Filling in the wings, Edwards and McDaniels. And it's Conley in at point. Now here's Looney. Pool outside. Let's go with a three. Another three for Golden State. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Conley against Poole. The kick out to Edwards. The Timberwolves need to get off a shot here. Gobert. Missed it, even after all of those chances. Yeah, and it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. Thompson finds Poole. There's the triple. The basket's good. Off the assist from Thompson. Poole's got six. He drops yet another dime. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Pass to McDaniels. That's tipped. Now here's Conley. From deep three-point range. Kept alive by Minnesota. No good on the shot. Hate to say it, but if they're still trailing at the final buzzer, a lot of this is going to be felt by him. His shooting tonight has just been atrocious. And here's Thompson for three. And the Warriors with another three. They've been very well-rounded and extremely focused. Coaching staff probably most proud of the effort of this team on both ends of the floor here tonight. Now here's Edwards looking for his first basket still in this one. Yeah, my expectations were that he was not going to miss that one. He handles that kind of defense, especially on the inside. And there's the basket. And the whistle blows. Chance at a three-point play here. Going to the line for one. Defensive foul, Carl Anthony Towns. First personal foul, first team foul. At the line for the Warriors, Draymond. I mean, so much glue in this guy as Draymond focuses on making all the winning plays that he possibly can. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Edwards against Thompson. Edwards, a pass to Towns. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. For a big, Towns is an effective free throw shooter. You really can't give him too many looks from the line. That free throw, no good. At the line for two. And he sinks the second. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second. Here's Thompson. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Thompson's got five points now in the quarter. Thompson, a guy who has size and has strength and has taken shots like that before. And that was the mobile one drive. No resistance to the finish line. With the lead they have, you might think they'd start to settle, but they are still going at the rim strong. It's so sick, the vertical ability. That was flat out awesome. He has that effortless knack for getting to the hoop. The shot by Looney, no good. And there's a little bit of pressure on him, but not enough to cause him to miss a shot that's in that close. McDaniels can't hit. And the Warriors with possession. They're on a 14-3 run to the middle. Ooh, Gobert with a steal. Here's the break. 
Here's Edwards. They get the rebound. McDaniels. Pass to Edwards. Poole against Conley. Shot clock at six. Outside McDaniels. The three. The shot misses. I just, I've not seen him shoot this poorly, guys, in a game this season. Green up top. Now Poole. Beyond the arc. Green, the pass to Looney. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. And what's working here, each guy is willing to make the next pass. And a new group getting ready for the Warriors. Green's checked in for Draymond Green. Kaminga comes in for Andrew Wiggins. DiVincenzo, he's checked in for Thompson. And it's Curry in for Poole. Here's Prince. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. The ball's knocked loose. And the shot clock expires. 24-second violation. And the Warriors making a change here. Lamb's checked in. Into the lineup for your Warriors, Anthony Lamb. Here's DiVincenzo. Green, the pass to Curry. From deep. No luck on that one. Now Minnesota takes it the other way. Here's Prince. That shot off the mark. Good work defensively by DiVincenzo. 1.14 left in the first half. From behind the arc. Rebounded by the Timberwolves. After scoring with ease in the first quarter, he's really cooled down a bunch here. Here's Noel. DiVincenzo covering. Here's Prince. Ooh, once again, off the mark by Minnesota. The Warriors have gotten six of ten shots to drop in the second. Nice work. Green finds Curry. Takes the three. Bucket. He's now nine for 11 after that one. Getting a lot of nice work now from the field. He's helped get them this lead, and now he's helped them keep it. Pass to Anderson. Wing shot on the way. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Here's Golden State. They're on a 19-3 run. The three from Curry. Reed with the rebound. Things are going south right now. This is not the type of shooting that his teammates expect from him. Here's Prince. Knocked away. It's stolen by Green. Oh, and a fast break for the Warriors. He got it up. Good. Another from three. Buries his 10th triple of the game. Unbelievable, B.A. Unbelievable. And so it's the Golden State Warriors showing no mercy and just piling it on, looking dominant and focused right now. A big difference in shooting percentages. That's why they lead. We'll be right back. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Ernie Johnson with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. How about the playoff atmosphere? We're going to break down all the first half action for you. Well, for Golden State, they're in a perfect position to grab a hold of this series, up 1-0 already, and playing incredible basketball, which has given them a huge lead at halftime. Uh, they just couldn't have asked for a better scenario. Taking a look at the Warriors, Kenny, what would you think? Well, it comes down to confidence. From the opening tip, these guys had that swag. They had the attitude that you can't beat us, we can only beat ourselves. And Shaq, what do you think about Minnesota? When you look at their multiple areas of weakness, for me, it starts with their primary defense. This organization, they have a lot of wide open looks. They have to communicate better and stay connected to the shooters. And that's going to do it for our halftime show, sadly. Third quarter about to start. See you again after the final. Horn. Oh, buzzer. Get ready to move. 
And we're back with you folks as this exciting Western Conference semifinal game rolls on. Stephen Curry having a dominant impact in this game. Yeah, he played such a smart first half, maximizing his opportunities offensively. Yeah, I'm thinking back to the first half and wondering, did he take a low percentage shot? Everything efficient. The core of the dynasty all on the floor. Curry and Clay, the guards, with Draymond up front at the four. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Kevon Looney. So that's the group out there for Golden State. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. Yeah, taking the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the defense and made them pay. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Outside Edwards. Outside McDaniels. Got a piece of it. Wiggins with a steal. The rebound by the Timberwolves. McDaniels with it. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Curry with a steal. Wiggins finds Thompson. This one for three. It's not going to go for him. Now Minnesota takes it the other way. Left side, Conley. Off the left rim and out. The Warriors have gone just one of three in the second half. Thompson passes to Curry. From downtown, connects again from distance. He's been on the money from deep. Definitely looking to shoot as much as possible. Conley with the ball. And Looney picks him up defensively. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So Second he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. First the defense foul. tries to stop Conley with a foul, but he shows great poise and manages to get it off. That free throw no good. Cool. He's checked in for Thompson. And he's good on the second. Yeah, one of the best leaders in the NBA. This team loves having Mike Conley in their locker room. And here's Curry for three. Carl Anthony Towns comes up with a rebound. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. Conley against Curry. Here's Edwards. They get it back. Golden State has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. Pass to Wiggins. Back to Curry. 4-3. Buries it from three. Curry's got 41. Wow. Their opponent is doing a tremendous job spacing the floor. Conley goes in. That shot is off. Green with the defensive effort. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. And here's Curry for three. And again for three. Unbelievable shooting. And he continues to climb the all-time leaderboards for threes made in the playoff game. Offensive fireworks from long range. Putting on a show on the big stage. Cool. the pass to Looney. Conley against Curry. The three is up. And the Warriors with another three. He's played a huge role in this game to this point, but it looks like he just wants more. He wants to make sure that this lead holds up. Pass to Gobert. Outside Edwards. Over Looney. And the foul is called. He missed it. So he's got a couple of free throws coming this way. Kevon Looney picks one up. Well, that was clearly a foul. The first free throw is good. And some changes here for the Warriors. Green's checked in for Looney. Kaminga comes in for Draymond Green. And it's DiVincenzo in for Wiggins. And a new group getting ready for the Timberwolves. Reed's checked in for Gobert. Anderson comes in for Carl Anthony Towns. Prince is checked in for McDaniels. And Rivers is subbed in for Conley. The Warriors have gotten five of eight shots to go in the third. The three from Curry. Minnesota with a rebound. Over to the left wing from outside the arc. Prince can't hit. And the Warriors with possession. They're on a 15-3 run. The three, DiVincenzo, sends it home from three-point land. 
DiVincenzo, Scott Six. This is what it's been since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. Yeah, pretty infectious right here. Guys in good spirits and percentages from downtown on the rise in the second half. This is you want to run your offense through him. Rivers. A reliable scoring option. Two minutes remaining. Outside on the Curry. Two minutes. Puts up a three. And the Warriors get it back. DiVincenzo finds Poole. The three from Curry. Not going to go that time. Now Minnesota takes it the other way. Here's Edwards. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Edwards got eight points in the quarter. Well, he's been carrying them all night on offense, but at some point, he's going to need some help. And here's Curry for three. Good! Another from three. The three is coming fast and furious. He is scorching the nets. Yes, and now tied for the third most three-point field goals in a single game in playoff history. That's not going to make you a favorite target of your teammates. They'll think twice about feeding you if you're going to keep missing layups. And he gets that one. Give him eight points now. Well, he's got no problems getting inside if there's that kind of room available. Dante with two. Pass to Edwards. 51 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's Rivers. That shot missing. Green with the defensive effort. Outside Curry. The three is up. Connects again from distance. And he's notched the third most three-pointers in a single game in NBA playoff history. Yes, one of the best games of his life, or anyone's for that matter. He has been unstoppable. Edwards against Poole. DiVincenzo with the steal. In transition, here come the Warriors. That one's good from Green. And the assist by DiVincenzo. Green's got his first points of the night. And sometimes the simplest play is the best one. DiVincenzo made it. Edwards can't hit. The other team just looks more in sync and is riding the momentum. Well, the other team is scorching hot, and they come down on this end and can't find a way to get the Embers going. Like a matador. Ole! There was no defense. The it has to be one of the easiest shots I've seen tonight. Yeah, feels like Christmas right now, just gift-wrapping things. Stephen Curry getting it done for the Warriors. He was dominant this quarter, scoring in bunches. We'll be right back after this word. All right, let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. And from the two-guard spot, an unselfish play like this sets a fantastic tone. Even though the position is called shooting guard, passing part of your responsibilities in today's game. Hey there, everyone. Happy Cinco de Mayo to all of you as we get you back to some NBA action. And a look now at the five for the Timberwolves to start the fourth quarter. We've got Jalen Noel. Torian Prince is out there with Carl Anthony Towns. Then it's Nikhil Alexander-Walker. And it's Moore in at the small forward position. Pass to Alexander-Walker. Here's Moore. Five on the clock. Stolen by Lamb. Oh, and a fast break for the Warriors. Now here's Curry. Defense is right there. Let's the three fly. Good! Another from three. He's putting on a shooting exhibition that has left this entire arena in awe. And you know he finds himself tied for second place all time and three point makes for a playoff game. Pass to Moore. Towns with the ball. Four on the clock. Here's Noel. Here's Prince. Hangs in the air. Hauled in by DiVincenzo. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Outside Curry. No good on the three. 
and he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. The Warriors have gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Puts up a three. Minnesota with a rebound. Here's Noel. Pass to Moore. Now here's Towns. Poke loose. DiVincenzo with a steal. Oh, and a fast break for the Warriors. Takes a three. Pure from three-point range. And a look at how the hustle game has been going for the Warriors. Yeah, they've collected an impressive number of steals so far, using fast hands to force some turnovers, and then scoring on the other end. Man, scoring off of turnovers is so helpful. I mean, you get easy opportunities at the rim. It devastates the opponent. They've done a great job tonight at converting on those chances. The Warriors have gone three of five since this fourth quarter started. And here's Curry for three. Carl Anthony Towns comes up with a rebound. Here's Noel. He's covered by Curry. Noel, that's good. Disappointing as a player to have such a great game and still be trailing. Not over yet, though. The three from Curry. They get it again. Lamb passes to Curry. The three. And got it. Another basket. I mean, when you see a player get this hot in a playoff game, oh, oh my. Oh. Well, I know this. He now ranks third all-time for single-game scoring in the postseason. Simply stunning. 20 feet out. Iguodala with the rebound. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. DiVincenzo, pass to Iguodala. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Iguodala's got his first basket of the night. Iguodala is so skilled down low, playing his cards right that time and laying them on the table. And we just had to take one more look at that great drive. And this is exactly what you love to see. Up big, not letting up, keep on applying pressure to their defense. Knocks it loose. Here's Noel. Cashes it in from 11 feet. Noel. Noel's got six here in the quarter. Here's Golden State. Two minutes They're on a 14 to six run. Outside Curry. And yes, another basket. And he's now claimed the second most points ever in a playoff game. Just roasting the defense. Nobody's been able to contain him. Here's Alexander Walker. DiVincenzo covering. Six to shoot. Noel, no good. One side is dominated tonight. Yeah, they've done a fantastic job of imposing their pace and style of play. Curry gets the bucket. And so that's the end of game two. No question, this is a big win for the Warriors. And the disparity in the talent was obvious by the end. Sometimes you just don't have enough ammunition to compete. Yeah, B.A., just a total beatdown. And the next time these teams meet, I can't imagine it'll be any different. This team is playing with confidence and heart right now. They're in control of this series so far. Yeah, no question. They are the more cohesive team right now. Just going out there and executing their game plan. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped fuel this team to victory was the efficiency for Stephen Curry. It looked like a couple times they might be wearing him down, but not the case. At the offensive end, he was just devastating. Launches a three. Hits yet again. Wow. The scoring tonight, just mind-blowing. And he's nearing first all-time for scoring in a playoff game. And Dante DiVincenzo is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. Dayton's checked in for the Warriors. Reed's checked in for Minnesota. McLaughlin comes in for Noel. Here's Reed. Up and in on the layup. It's nice to see they're not settling for three-pointers. These guys are putting in the work inside. Iguodala finds Peyton. And it's flushed down. A nice game. 
finishing the game strong. This is how you shut the door on any hopes of a comeback. Yeah, definitely putting a stamp on this one. A very, very decisive victory for the club tonight. Pass to Reed. Here's McLaughlin. Charity stripe shot. Down to five on the shot clock. Alexander Walker. Out to the right wing. And so it's the Warriors taking care of business in this one. And this win shows they have the momentum so far in the series. Up two games to none now. They just look so confident out there. They're playing selfless ball and their chemistry has never looked better. Time for us to say goodbye. We hope you enjoyed our second round coverage of the NBA Western Conference playoffs. For Ali LaForce, Brent Barry, Grant Hill, and our entire 2K Sports crew, this is Brian Anderson signing off. We'll see you next time.